Hey everyone, we're back with another quick video. Uh, Lucas unfortunately isn't feeling all that great right now. Uh, you probably shouldn't be hanging out with me when I have the flu. Maybe a bad idea in hindsight, recording videos and everything, but uh, that's all right. Uh, but he's getting through this quick video uh, because I added a piece to my Cleveland Indians collection. Which I don't know about. <laughs> and I'm pretty excited about it. Uh, first I want to go over, if you watched my collection video from maybe what, two months ago? Where we showed off the basement. Uh, you saw a couple of these pieces, but real quick, a uh, couple small pieces in my collection. I'm not a huge collector. I don't have a basement full of stuff. But I did get this autographed baseball uh, from a nice gentleman who went down to spring training uh, in Arizona last year. It has a number of Indian signatures on it. Uh, I'll read you down the list real quick. Uh, Walters, Hagedon, McAllister, uh, Mark, uh, that was um, not Radcliffe, uh, God, Rizimski, I think. Uh, Rayburn, Perez, Swisher, Jesus Azalar, uh, Salazar, Tomlin, Murphy, Alvarez, Atchison, Shaw, Household, Bonnie Chisenhall, Carrasco, and Carlos Santana. So that is one of the showpieces of my Indians collection. The other one is the autographed by uh, manager Terry Francona. This was the actual schedule to the Indians uh, versus... Vers uh, ticket doesn't say it on the back. Uh, well, you could definitely... Yeah, versus the Twins. I wonder why it says that versus Tor. Oh, because that's the tour we took on the field. Yeah. I don't have the actual ticket in there. Uh, but this is where they played the Twins. We went on the tour of the field beforehand. Uh, this is... He handed out, out the whole team. It was Bourne, Swisher, Kipnis, Santana, uh, Brantley, Cabrera, Gomes, Chisenhall, Stubbs, and McAllister. Uh, you can see some of them were cross rubbed out, rewritten yeah, in as they made substitutions. Uh, I was going to say, where's Stephen Kipnis? <laughs> yeah, very cool, huh? Oh, there he is. Yeah, right up there. Number one. And then uh, Terry oh, wait, Francona's four, right? signature down there. He was uh, batting third. Oh, the four is the position. Uh, it has the little hologram on top of Major League Baseball. <laughs> Because if it's one thing baseball likes doing, it's selling stuff. So uh, we bought that when we went to the first Indians game with the kids in uh, Cleveland. So I happened to get a pretty good deal on eBay. eBay, I know, I know. Uh, but it was a good deal. I, there's a place selling things called SIDS Graphs. Uh, very high number of feedback, very positive. I watched their auctions for a while. They seemed very legit. So I ordered a Jason Kipnis autographed bat. Um, did you get it? I did. Uh, I actually ordered the uh, beige one, uh, and eBay had sent me, a, they had a coupon for March Madness, $20 off any $100 purchase. Ooh. So it was $115, I, uh, it was $100, it was $100 with $15 shipping, I offered them $85, so it would come up to exactly $100, they accepted it, I took my $20 off, so I paid $80 bucks for it, then they... <coughs> excuse me, emailed me, told me that uh, they had an inventory mistake and they were out of that item. They offered me the black one instead, which was actually a little bit more, but looks just as cool. So without further ado, I'm going to reveal to Lucas the newest piece of my Cleveland Indians collection. It's long. It also looks like a bat. <laughs> Jason Kipnis, the name burnt on there, autographed. H heavy. Have you? Yeah. Oh, yeah, it is pretty heavy. Yeah. Very cool. I don't know how they use these bats. <laughs> That's a, oh. I think, a, a very sharp looking uh, display piece. And I'm very, hey, rock. very excited to uh, add it in my old collection. Um, one of the things they did is they had the PSA DNA and it matches the sticker on the bottom, which is always good. So when I go online, I type in the number off the bat or the card and it tells me, yes, this is authenticated by PSA DNA. It's a rookie graph, uh, which they only do during the player's first season. So he signed this when he was a rookie and they included a photograph of uh, Jason Kipnis at their store signing the bats. That's cool. 
It is very cool. Uh, so I'm very happy with it. I was glad with the customer service. The speed, I couldn't believe it. I think I bought it on uh, Friday and it arrived on Monday. So ridiculous shipping. Three days. Uh, just amazing. Well packaged. Uh, again, that was SIDS Graphs. S-I-D-S-G-R-A-P-H-S. Uh, they have a couple other items I'm looking at now. Uh, maybe adding to the collection as well. So kind of keep my eye out on them. But I just wanted to show off the new piece. I was so excited when it arrived. Because uh, I wanted a, a pretty nice display piece. Something a little more substantial. And uh, How are you going to display it? I'm going to get a little holder for it. Oh, yeah. Okay. And one thing I did learn is that wall-mounted uh, bat displays are expensive. So I'll probably go with a nice little, you know, two-prong or just a display like that. It's in the basement. No direct sunlight or anything, so it'll be fine. Uh, very, very cool. So thank you for watching uh, my little recap video of my newest uh, collection item. Uh, we got a bunch of box breaks coming up. We got Gypsy... For group breaks, we got Gypsy Queen... Uh, we got Donruss, and we got the museum collection. So uh, let me know if you're interested in that. Uh, we were going to do the Doctor Who box break today, but Lucas filmed a under the weather, so we'll put that off for a little while, let him get some rest. Um, anything else going on with you? No? Just want to chillax? Can do. I can't blame you there. All right, so thank you very much for watching, guys. We will be back again real soon. As always, I'm Matt. Yeah, I'm Lucas. Thanks very much for watching, guys. Have a great night. Bye.